All right. Hey guys, welcome to my much needed closet clean out. Today we are going through everything in my closet and we're gonna decide which items I'm going to keep and which ones I'm gonna sell or donate. My closet has been a little bit out of control and I'm so bad at selling or donating clothes because I always think, oh, maybe one day in the future I still want to wear this and I'm just afraid that I will regret doing stuff away. So I'm not the best at it, but it really needs to happen. So I think we're gonna start with tops. Um, yeah. Okay, I'm keeping my favorite basic tank tops and crop tops. So definitely keeping this one. I also have the same in brown. And then I have this cropped black top that I'm always wearing. So definitely keeping these. This is the first one that I haven't been wearing a lot, but the thing is with this top is that I thrifted it in Australia. So I don't think I'm ready to let this one go. I bought this one in London. It's a keeper for sure. This is another really nice basic. Definitely keeping this. Keeping, I really like the back. I'm keeping this one. Definitely keeping this one. I think that tube tops are fun, but I just don't think that they're the most leathering top for me but I don't think I'm ready to let this one go. Same with this one. I think it's so cute. I mean there's nothing wrong with it. I just don't really wear this. <sighs> but here we go. I just can't really let things go. This is a Brittany Melville crop top. I haven't worn this in ages but I still really like it. <laughs> oh I'm the worst. Okay, this is going into a maybe pile because I'm not too sure yet. Definitely gonna let go of this one. Another Brandy Melville t-shirt. Um, I really like this one still, so definitely keeping this. Got this really cute set. I recently got this actually from Wellbeing Being Well. And I have a matching pair of shorts. And this is actually my favorite at home uniform. Absolutely love with jean t-shirt. One of my favorites at the moment. So keeping this. I have so many oversized t-shirts. I really love this one. The back is really cool. And I bought this in a size extra, extra large. I really like wearing this as kind of like a dress too. We gotta do something about my white basic t-shirts because I have too many. These are all basic white t-shirts. Ah, oh, this one is really cool. It's my friend's boyfriend designed this. You probably see me wear this all the time. So keeping this. Years. Maybe. <laughs> I think I'm keeping this, which brings me to this one. But then again, why can I just have a few more basics? I think we're keeping this. I'm sorry, we're keeping this. Now I kind of have the same problem with black t-shirts. I just have too many black t-shirts too. This is just a nice H&M t-shirt. I'm keeping this. I don't know about this one. It says tree huggers, which I think is a really nice fit for me, but I don't really wear this as much, but maybe if I just put it a bit more in the front of my closet, I will wear it more. We have another black t-shirt. This one has a little cup of coffee. I'm gonna let this one go. Okay, we have another t-shirt that I don't really wear, but that I bought in Australia. So I'm kind of emotionally attached to this. I like it, but I think I need to let this one go because I just don't wear it. More oversized t-shirts. I think I'm keeping this one, but I have something a little bit similar. And that is this t-shirt from Unique. I like the back a lot, but I don't know, the front just, I don't know. I don't know enough about this one. Um, from the same brand, I have this pink t-shirt. David got me this and I really love it still. So keeping this one. Basic yellow t-shirt, keeping this one. Okay, we're moving on to long sleeves. Just a basic striped t-shirt is just something that you really need, I think, as a basic in your wardrobe. So definitely keeping this one. This is one of my favorite turtlenecks. Actually not a turtleneck, it's like a mock neck and I think it's very flattering. I wear this so much, so 
definitely keeping this. This red turtleneck is actually one of the most colorful <laughs> items that I have. As you can probably tell, I have a lot of like black, white, and gray. Keeping this. I actually recently got this long sleeve and I think it was kind of a mistake. I thought it would be a bit longer and I don't know, I just don't like this as a cropped shirt, especially during fall. I'm not gonna wear a cropped long sleeve. I'm gonna get rid of this. I think this is the most beautiful top I own at the moment. I recently got this from Revolve. It's from the brand House of Harlow and it is just so beautiful. I'm absolutely in love with this. Okay, we're moving on to shirts and those are in here. <sighs> These are all my shirts. I'm definitely keeping this one. I wear this all the time. You guys see me wear this. I really need the same type of shirt in black and white, especially black because I have something quite similar in white, but I need this in black. This Lee shirt, wear this all the time, so I'm keeping this one. My, ooh, also wear this all the time, so keeping this. This one, I don't know. I'm gonna let this one go. Yeah, I'm keeping this. I really like it. This is another one that I don't really know. I kind of like it, but it's just not really my vibe anymore. It's a Carhartt shirt, so it's cool, but I don't really know if I like it. I think I'm gonna let this one go. Moving on to my crew necks. I'm keeping all of these because I just love my crew necks. Um, I love them. I'm not gonna get rid of any of these. I'm sorry. I have this blazer, oversized black blazer, really love it. I have been looking for a nice oversized blazer last year and I found this one and I really like it, so I'm keeping this one. Another blazer, I think I'm keeping this one. Now, I have this leather blazer um, that I really like, but I'm always wearing my big oversized leather coat and I don't really wear this anymore. I really like it, but I think I'm gonna sell this because it's just not really my vibe anymore. Okay, we are moving on to bottoms. And I'm really not looking forward to this, but we gotta do it. So let's start with some of the things that I'm definitely keeping. So I really love this skirt, but I definitely think this is just gonna be one of these like trendy items that I'm not gonna be wearing for a lot of years because it is like a low waist and it's just not the most comfortable thing, but I am keeping this. this short for years and there's nothing wrong with it but I lived through this thing for so many years and I'm just gonna get rid of this. Okay I'm keeping this this black skirt then I have another black skirt but this one is a little bit more chic. Then we have another black skirt this one is denim. Um, I've had this for years it's time to say goodbye. And then I have another black skirt. Um, I don't really like this one anymore. It's just a black skirt. It's not really, there's nothing really to like, but this one has gotta go. Keeping this, really like this one still. Um, I do need to iron this. <laughs> I am creating such a mess. I'm going to show you once I tried everything on, what my room looks like right now. And it's awful, but it's part of the process. Moving on to dresses. I was never really a dress type of girl, but recently I've been really into dresses and this is my absolute favorite dress that I own. It's from Realization. I feel so elegant in this dress, so I am just in love. Love, love, love. I have had this dress for years. It is from Brills and I'm definitely bringing this one to Italy to keeping this. Iconic Brandy Melville dress. <laughs> I've had this for so long. Oh, I'm sweaty, but I still like it. I'm keeping this. I think I'm gonna keep all of my dresses honestly, but just for the purpose of this video, I'm gonna try them on anyway. Okay, moving on to kind of like jumpsuits and I have two dungarees, two pair of dungarees. I'm keeping these, I really love. Um, this is like a boiler suit from 
weekday. Last but not least, we're moving on to pants and jeans. These are my Dickies, really love them, keeping them for sure. My previous favorite blue jeans were the weekday voyage, but they are just done. They had a great life and they served me well, but it was time for me to let go of my favorite blue jeans. And I recently got these new pair that I was wearing before. And these are actually my favorite jeans at the moment. They're super down. Love these. I have my 501s Levi's. Definitely keeping these. I also have them in black. Keeping these. These ones I'm actually not too sure about. I like them, but I just never really wear them. They are also Levi's. I don't know which model it is, but I don't know. I don't really feel comfortable with these, so I think I'm gonna sell them. Black cargo pants. Absolutely love these. These are definitely trending right now and I'm pretty sure that next year I won't wear, wear them anymore But I really like them right now. This has been like my go-to festival pants this summer So I'm keeping this but I don't think it's gonna be a keeper for life for sure more jeans Keeping these of course, I just wear this around the house um, Yeah Keeping these I got these pants recently and I really, really like them because they are so comfortable but they also can look kind of chic um, if I wear it with a cute top. There's a big stain in here so I need to wash them actually. They are a bit see-through so I have to be careful with what I wear underneath but I really like these. Keeping this, of course. I was talking about the weekday voyage. I bought the same model in the same size in white. And as you can see, I just don't fit in them. And it really hurts my feelings because I paid quite a lot for these. I'm gonna get rid of these and get a size bigger because I really like this model. And I know that weekday has a very nice quality of jeans. But as you can see, I, can, I can't even close them when I I'm a bit bloated, so yeah, I'm gonna sell these, unfortunately. Okay, oh my god, we went through everything that I have in my closet here right now. I actually have more at my parents' house, which I don't even want to talk about. Um, I need to sort that out another time. Those are actually more of like my winter clothes, so I have a lot more hoodies and um, turtlenecks, big sweaters. I need to do that another time, but oh my God, let me show you what it looks like right now. Oh my God, <laughs> this is everything that I'm keeping, everything that I'm selling or donating, and then more stuff that I'm keeping. I am going to organize all of this, but first I need a break. I think I'm just gonna make a quick start with organizing everything and then I'm going to take a little break because I'm kind of done and I don't want to deal with this anymore. Even though I made this mess myself, so I do need to fix it. But yeah, and then I'm taking a break and then I'm going to make pictures, everything, get everything ready for Vinted. I don't really sell on Depop, so if you want to follow me on Vinted, I will leave my um, profile in the description. Okay, I can see the floor again. I put everything away. I made some pictures for Vinted and yeah, now I'm just gonna sell everything or donate whatever I don't want to sell. And now I have more room in my closet to shop for new things. No, just kidding. I really need to slow it down with my shopping behavior. Anyways, uh, that's it for today. I really hope you guys enjoyed. Thanks for watching and I'll see you guys next week. I really wanna do, I wanna love